What's up, everybody on YouTube? AJ Russ back here with another video. And today we'll be talking about why Dak Prescott will be a legit MVP contender in the 2021 season. The Dallas Cowboys have been known for a while as America's team and one of the more trademark franchises in professional sports. But with them not capturing a Super Bowl since 1995, their relevancy has been put into question and many have looked at them as a joke in this new millennium. Since drafting Dak Prescott in the fourth round in the 2016 NFL Draft, the Cowboys found an absolute stud of a quarterback for Mississippi State, turning heads in the 2016 NFL preseason and eventually taking longtime Dallas quarterback Tony Romo's job after Romo suffered a back injury. That same season in 2016, as rookies Dak Prescott and running back Ezekiel Elliott helped lead the Cowboys to an NFC leading 13-3 record clinching a first round bye, but then lost to the future Hall of Famer Aaron Rodgers and the Green Bay Packers in the second round of the NFL playoffs. Despite the early exit, Cowboys fans were excited for the first time in a while for a resurgence in the franchise behind their young core. That newfound optimism became more slim though when in 2017 the Cowboys finished with a lackluster 9-7 record missing the playoffs and witnessing divisional rival Philadelphia Eagles win the Super Bowl. The Cowboys made the playoffs in 2018, making it to the second round, but then eventually lost to the NFC champions of that year, the Los Angeles Rams. With those up and down seasons, people in the NFL media and across the sports world have questioned Dak's ability to be a franchise quarterback and have also questioned where he ranks among the top quarterbacks in the league. After having a 10-6 record in the 2018 NFL season, Dallas had a mediocre 8-8 record in the 2019 season and then let go of longtime head coach Jason Garrett. Negotiations between Dak and the Cowboys about a contract extension have been the talk of the sports world, and Prescott ended up playing the 2020 season on a franchise tag. Dak was in play for a huge campaign ahead of the 2020 season. Even though it was a pandemic year, Prescott was ready to show his value. He started off the year on fire, throwing for 1,856 passing yards in the first five games of the season on pace for a career year. This dominance was unfortunately cut short though when Dak suffered a dislocated compound fracture in week five of the 2020 season against the New York Giants. That injury basically took Cowboys fans out of hope for a postseason run due to not only losing Dak for the season, but also having one of the worst defenses in NFL history. With Dak being injured, the offensive production took a huge drop off. Before the injury, the Cowboys offense averaged 32.6 points per game with Dak. But without Dak, the Cowboys averaged 21.1 points per game, a 12 point difference. These factors along with a new head coach in Mike McCarthy and a team with no identity led the Cowboys to having an awful 6-10 record in the 2020 season. This dysfunction and disaster of a season proved how much of an impact Dak has on the Dallas Cowboys culture. With the season they had, you would think after that they would immediately want to extend Dak to his deserved long-term deal. That wasn't the case though as negotiation lingered even longer than they should have and the Dallas Cowboys finally signed Dak to a 4 year $160 million contract on March 8, 2021. Cowboys fans were relieved to know that Dak re-signed and felt even more encouraged in his first press conference after signing his new deal. He talked about how he only envisioned himself being in a Cowboys uniform and knew that the deal would eventually be done. Dak also updated the status of his ankle, saying it feels even better than before after recovery and therapy, preparing for the 2021 season. With Prescott preparing for a resurgent year this upcoming season, this and many other reasons are why Dak will be a top five MVP candidate in the 2021 NFL season. Him on the field leading his team and shifting the culture to his teammates on offense and those on defense bring a different level of intensity to the Cowboys franchise. The NFL world saw how the Cowboys struggled immensely offensively without Dak, but also the defense was horrendous. This past offseason though, the Cowboys hired former defensive coordinator of the leading the Boom Seahawks in Dan Quinn. Quinn was most recently the head coach of the Atlanta Falcons, where he led the Falcons to the Super Bowl in 2017. And in 2013, as defensive coordinator of the Seahawks, he won a Super Bowl. With him looking to change the Cowboys' defensive culture, along with drafting star Penn State linebacker Micah Parsons and a slew of defensive reinforcements in the 2021 draft, I believe this will help take pressure off Dak and improve the Cowboys as a whole with a better defense. Those combined factors and a more healthy Cowboys team, I believe Dak will have a legit chance at winning the 2021 NFL MVP and leading the Cowboys to the playoffs. Some quote unquote experts may say otherwise, but the Cowboys have real talent, especially offensively, for Dak to showcase his transcendent abilities. Having C.D. Lamb, Amari Cooper, and Michael Gallup provides Prescott with one of the best receiving cores in the NFL. Not to mention, they still have Ezekiel Elliott, who struggled last year without Dak, but is also looking to prove himself as one of the top running backs in the league again. And they also have an underrated dynamic running back in Tony Pollard. With a new team in place and improvements all around on offense and defense, 
Prescott has significantly more help than he did last year. As long as Dak stays healthy and poised along with his amazing leadership, he'll not only be a perennial MVP candidate, but he also may be the best quarterback in the 2021 season, especially if he puts up video game stats like he did at the beginning of 2020. Alright guys, so I hope y'all enjoyed the video. Dak has been one of the best quarterbacks in the NFL for the past few years, and I believe this season, he'll be able to elevate his game even higher, potentially becoming an MVP. Stay tuned for more content about the NFL. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and turn on post notifications. Follow me on Instagram and Twitter at SwaggyRust, and I hope y'all are doing well, staying safe, and y'all have a good one.